Hi everybody, welcome back. Today is day 21, the day after Father's Day. I'm starting off my card with a brick stencil and some uh, modeling paste. My card is not um, prepared, it's not covered with any gesso. It's just the card all by itself because I wanted it to soak up the, the color that I'm going to apply on it. What I'm spritzing on it is actually pink food coloring mixed with water in a spritz bottle. And yeah, it's the napkin is sticking to it because I did not dry the modeling piece when I put it on. So I'm now drying everything. <laughs> so it's just modeling piece, no gesso on the card. Now I'm going to apply some more food coloring. This one is yellow. My thumb blocked that part of it. And now one spritz of gray. Sorry, green. Wow. <laughs> I found this heart when I was looking for some papers and I decided to use it. So now I'm going to put some modeling paste around the heart, but I want it to be full of texture. So I'm uh, tapping it on. You know, I'm not applying it smoothly. I'm tapping it so that it will get some nice raised texture. And I was going to move it and do some other stuff, but then I got an idea to just add color around the heart alone. So now again, I'm going in with some more food coloring and water. And I'm spritzing regular water right now to help the food coloring move. And I was kind of freaking out a little bit because I didn't want any food coloring to run under the, the, the heart. So I'm trying to dry it before I move it, just to try and help it along. And uh, it didn't turn out too bad. Just had a little seepage by the, you know, where the, it goes in the middle, but it was okay. I was quite happy. And then I was thinking, what am I going to do next? So I decided to outline my heart with a, a graphite pencil, charcoal pencil, and trying to activate it with water, but it's having giving some trouble. So I found my Stabilo Oil pencil, which is super fantastically gel-like. It just glides on the card, no matter what you have on your card, it just glides on it. It's fantastic. Oh my goodness. And I'm activating that with some water, giving it a nice outline. And as I'm doing this, I'm thinking, guard your heart. So we have some rough texture outside. We have some inside too, but there's more outside. You know, you have the regular raised one, the brick one, and then you have the bumpy one and it's not coming inside so the bible tells us um, in, proverbs, in proverbs chapter 4 and verse 23 to keep thy heart with all diligence for out of it are the issues of life so keep thy heart meaning protect it guard it with all diligence with all your might with all your power with all your energy because whatever goes inside of your heart, that is what is going to come out. Whatever goes in is what comes out. So we have to guard our hearts. We have to be careful with what we let into our lives. The negatives, the abuse, the all the negativity, the jealousy, the pride, all the things that we invite into our hearts. We need to be careful and we need to watch 
what is going in and stop it from coming in. So I'm using my letter stamp and I'm just cleaning. Actually, I'm cleaning the stamp right now and I decided to do it on the card instead of on a scrap paper because even though we do try to guard our heart, sometimes we let our guard down and things get in. So while outside might look messy and dark, inside, you know, it looks lighter, but there's still stuff that's coming in. And for me, you know, that's what happens with me. So I need to work on that with me. So right now I am adding some little highlights with a... Um, white acrylic paint on the peaks of the modeling paste and that's basically it for my card thank you so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow for day 22 thank you so much everyone bye